what's going on youtube so i'm just gonna do a quick review of the scat pack after six months of over six months of ownership we got this thing back in february um so you know i'm gonna do a quick review of it show you guys what i like about it what i don't like about it uh, let's go ahead and get into it all right so from the get-go it's a little dirty we about to actually take it for a car wash right now um so first things first this is the wide body i didn't have a wide body before when i had the hellcat so definitely what i like about this is the fact that we got three or five tires you know we're not spinning it as much acting up on the street with the hellcat i almost killed myself a few times because we had you know the skinnier tires so this definitely helps out oh yeah yeah it's super dirty I'm about to clean this up guys like i said about to head to a car wash um the scat pack uh i don't know if the other hellcat i had was a little bit louder so they did some work um, I'm actually about to try to get the exhaust done, uh, mid muffler delete uh, next week, because um, yeah, it's not it's pretty it's loud, but it's not that loud. I'll, I'll go ahead and start it up. All right, so I'm about to go ahead and start it up. So I don't know what you guys think about that. I think it could be louder, to be honest. In my opinion, um, let's go ahead and see. You know, as far as space goes, definitely gotta love it. Um, these seats, if I want to, they can literally go all the way back. Like if I wanted to lay down. Um, so yeah, I love this. I love Chargers, man. They got so much space. It's basically, like a family size car, but it's it's literally a sedan, so it got a lot of space. I right, just went ahead and popped the hood. See what I don't like, or what I should say, what I miss. Man, this engine is super dirty. You guys, don't don't get on me. I know I gotta clean this thing up. Um, yeah, man, what I miss, I gotta hold this thing up because after the accident, it's all messed up. But what I miss about it, what I miss is the supercharger, man. That supercharger makes a whole difference. You gotta think these cars, man, these cars are literally super heavy. So, supercharger makes all the difference in the speed. Like, this thing will still get up to like, you know, 170 around there, but on the speed it does it, just completely different. So we're gonna go ahead and hop in, go take this thing for a wash, because it desperately needs one. Man, not only do we need to take this thing for a wash, we need to put some gas in it. I'm at 51 miles. Um, so since I'm already talking about gas and miles, um, I guess I'll just talk about like the mileage on this thing, how it gets. I'm at 11.3 right now. I don't know if you guys can see right there. So I'm at 11.3 right now miles per gallon. I would say how often I step on it, um i don't step on it that much i would say don't really step on it too too much um nothing crazy just a decent amount you know when i'm trying to get active all right let's go um so yeah as you can see right there this thing will definitely go this thing will definitely go all right so that's something i love about these cars like you know around 20 or 30 this shit will put you back on your seat man like there, it, it ain't it ain't no uh no denying that literally smell the smoke right now as i'm talking so yeah it, it ain't no denying that all right let me go ahead um this car if you wanted to it could definitely get more um or a better mile per gallon rate um mine is at 11 i've seen people have it at like seven eight um some people can have it at 19 it really depends how you're doing people think this car sucks on gas like these chargers suck on gas you know big v8s but if you're going like on a trip i've had so many like uh road trips on this car like going to the beach or uh, places like that um bro when you hop on a highway this thing will not eat no gas at all like i literally have let's say for example had like 180 say uh, a range take a whole trip and it'll only go down like 20 miles even though the trip is like a hundred over a hundred mile trip so the computer uh, the tends to like average it out and you basically save a lot on gas when you're doing longer trips really when this car sucks on on gas is when you're in the city you know tearing it up going crazy <clears throat> but you know it is what it is that's what you're buying this car for you know to have fun with it so there's no complaining there all, all in all though man i re i love chargers man scat packs hellcats love it um i just love them bro that's why i got them um 
I'm thinking about getting another Hellcat. We about to see, about to see how it how it goes. But yeah, man, ain't no complaints. I, I might mess around, add some more stuff, some more modifications to the car. Like you know, a mid muffler delete. It might straight pipe. It might not. You know, give you know. I don't care. The engine light come on. I might have to straight pipe it just to have this stand loud, man. Um, but yeah, all in all, I really enjoy the car. I love it. I have fun with it every day. It's a great daily driver. Um, definitely recommend 10 out of 10. Um, one thing I like about Chargers better than Challengers, so much more spacious. Um, if you guys ever ran a Camaro, I had a Camaro at one point, bro, for like a week. <laughs> LOL. Uh, that Camaro, bro, they are so small. So I love how big Chargers are. Like, there's so much space in here, bro. So I love that. I already know, man. Getting it done. <laughs> Quick and easy. Right. I'm at the car wash now. Just took it through the wash. I'm about to throw some of this stuff away, man. Just like that, man. We got it looking nice again. All clean. Got that shit taken care of. Uh, let's hit a quick vacuum on it. Looking real nice now. All right, we're about to head out. Um, that's pretty much it, guys. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll be posting more, more daily stuff. Try to make more content for you guys. Um, go ahead and stay tuned. See you guys later.